good morning you guys happy Saturday morning um, it is what time is it it's, uh, almost seven o'clock so I've been up for a couple hours and just trying to get my life in order um, long story short we are supposed to get a ginormous storm you guys probably already know that <laughs> because it's probably already happened by the time you see this I'm getting this box on the duvet came in yesterday so that's good. I got the cover on that. I'm just waiting for the sheets to be done in here. I'll make this, well, they're in the washer. I just wanted to check. Oh, 17 minutes yet. So I just, I have to tell you guys, I just edited the vlog yesterday of how I had grabbed the duvet cover to take with me to go find sheets. I don't know what I was thinking. I seriously was, I had so much to do that I didn't have time to stay in Green Bay. Anyway. I'll get that. I'll get those sheets at some point. I, I may have a little bit of extra time. I, I don't know. I don't know when I think I'm going to have extra time. So, I should turn the heat up because it's really cold outside. Um, Alexa, what's the temperature? Right now, it's minus 16 degrees. Today, expect a high of 9 degrees. Ooh, it's supposed to warm up all the way till night. It's 16 below right now. <laughs> so, the, the point of what I was saying is that I had to get up and get going and get a ton of stuff done. I have the tournament today, games to watch, and I need to be working it a little bit. Oh, I need to grab out that shirt and see if I need to, my Optimus shirt, and see if I need to get it into the dryer, like to get the wrinkles out, you know? Well, it's not too bad, but it couldn't hurt. <laughs> so, I... Uh, what I was trying to say is that all of a sudden, as of yesterday, I had a lot more work to get done today because I need to go to Chicago, well, Naperville, um, on Sunday instead of on Monday. If I wait to go Monday, I'm going to be driving in that mess, and then there's a chance I'm not going to get there, and that is a problem. We'll see how this goes. I've only ever used that steam refresh thing once. So, yeah, so I got up, got my, normally I do my laundry on Sunday. Not, not that it matters so much, but they're, they're, like my black work pants, I really want to take those along. I just prefer to wear black or like black and gray so I don't have to take multiple shoes. And I have a couple of days of visits. So those have to be done and I air dry those. So they need to be air drying today so that I can pack them tomorrow. It's just, <laughs> the storm has just put a whole wrench in my world. And... I have more work I need to get done, plus I need to get to these games and, you know. So I got a lot I need to get, get going on. So here's the duvet cover. It's, I did get another duvet, duvet. It was pretty easy. I didn't do any special, like, I did look up some videos when I was looking for duvets way back when and saw that there were certain ways you could, like, roll the thing up and roll up, but I didn't really have any issues getting it on there. Um, so, anyway. All right. With that, I just thought I would do a check-in. I'll kind of take you along my day here. Uh, loving the blinds. <laughs> Pretty happy about the blinds. And I'm going to hop in the shower. <clears throat> Since it's not, there's like 17 minutes left on that, I have time to hop in the shower. I did edit a vlog. Edit, <laughs> I did edit the vlog. So I have that um, rendering right now, and then I will get that up. So hopefully you guys have seen that. And I have beauty videos I need to edit, but that may just have to happen when I get down there. I'm going to have, you know, time to kill by myself that I wasn't expecting to have. So that's what's going on. Happy Saturday morning to you. <laughs> I'm going to go hop in the shower and I'll see you guys later. Good afternoon, you guys. So it's um, Tuesday, about 10 to 3. It has been an interesting couple of days, let me tell you. So I don't even know when the last time I vlogged is. I'm gonna guess it was Saturday, because I was very busy on Sunday. So I don't think I vlogged at all, I can't remember. But made the decision Friday to go down Sunday to uh, Naperville, that's where I was. You guys see that you probably can't, maybe behind me that it's like white out conditions right now. Um, so made the decision to go down Sunday. My appointments weren't until this morning. My first one was this morning at 9. And it was a training that I really wanted to make sure that I was there for. It's just it's something that brings value to my customer. You know what I mean? And it was just important to me not to bail. So I, so that's what I did. So I worked from my hotel room yesterday. I had dinner with a co-worker. Um, got a bunch of stuff done. I'm 
my hotel room. Uh, work wise, I mean. And I was supposed to have dinner with a customer tonight and then drive to Skokie, which is like an hour and a half, hour and 40 minutes, something like that, kind of north, um, for an appointment tomorrow at 10 a.m. So, um, the my boss's boss, VP of Sales, was at the meeting with me today. Um, so, sorry, I got interrupted there. So he was, um, he came with me today and afterward, Maybe it was even before. He's like, I just don't think this is a good idea for you. You know, after the dinner, you'll be driving in the dark. Um, and in case you aren't aware, I'm sure the whole world is aware at this point. And when you're watching this, you're probably I've already seen it a million times because I don't know when this is going to go up. But uh, there's supposed to be 50, it's supposed to be 50 below in Wisconsin, Chicago area, you know, Wisconsin, Illinois, and other areas as well. Those are the two areas I was paying attention to um, with the wind chill tomorrow. And so places are closing left and right. Anyway, I made the decision with, with, with him to cancel, reschedule my dinner for tonight and let the others that were going to the, there's a rep, we have a rep that was going to the trial tomorrow. Not like a trial, not like a court trial, like a product trial. He's going tomorrow. I mean, he lives in the area, so he was going. So I just made the decision to come back. And so after my appointment today, we had grab lunch and then I started back. So, um, and I'm probably an hour and a half from now, I guess. An hour and a half. So when I stopped to get Starbucks, checking my emails and lo and behold, where we were supposed to do the trial tomorrow, they've already decided to close down the facility. So their employees are now in that pool. So I'm really glad that I made the decision because otherwise, had I not done that, I would I would just be getting on the road like a half hour ago when I got the message. So that is what's going on. It has been a, quite a few years. And actually, I think the the wind chill is going to be a record in Illinois. Um, they heard that on the news, but it's been a long time since we've been this cold. So right now, it's one degree. I don't know what it is with the wind chill, but it's got to be at least 20 below with the wind chill. Um, when the wind picks up, it is because we got a bunch of snow, as you guys probably know as well. Um, I can't tell what they got here because it's blowing around so much, but because it's so cold, the snow is so powdery, it just blows all over the place. And so the winds are coming west to east and just blowing across them. <laughs> so every once in a while when the wind picks up, it's like a full on white out. So I'm just clipping along here. I just want to be home at this point. I am sick of driving in this mess. Um, I fortunately got down Sunday um, before a single flake fell and then all of the snow came on Monday. Um, I don't know what we got, eight inches maybe in Chano, I'm not, I'm not positive. Some of the areas in the state got 12-ish, I think. Not sure exactly, but because I the news that I was watching obviously was Chicago. Chicago got somewhere between four and eight, depending on where you are in Chicago land. So. so that now you're all up to date. I'm sure you were all curious what's going on. Um, so now I will have, I'm actually thankful I have a ton of stuff to get done, so I will work obviously from home the rest of the week. Work on getting some stuff done. And yeah, this weekend Steven is going to be in town, so we're going to be that. So he and I are going to have coffee on Saturday morning, so that will be good. It's always good to see him. And yeah, maybe we'll be able to help Wilson with some stuff in the store. Um, you know, in the evenings. Not tonight. Well, probably not tonight. But maybe, maybe tomorrow night. Depends on whether any of us want to go out. So yeah. Holy white out, Batman. Oh, boy, I'm ready. I'm ready. <laughs> I'm just ready to be home. All right, so there's your check-in. I'm gonna get back to being taken. Can you guys tell how all over the road I am? And not because I'm not paying attention, but because that is a gust of wind. I don't know what the wind gusts are right now, but it's a little bit crazy. You guys can probably hear it. My car is usually very quiet and it is really loud. So, all right, I'm gonna go and I'll chat with you guys later. Good morning, everybody. It's eight o'clock. Um, look at my new mug. Isn't it awesome? 
apparently I had to take a drink of coffee right that in there. So I just did a live on Instagram and used some old school makeup, which I am digging. Like old school meeting people used to talk about all the time and don't anymore, including myself. Satin taupe on my lids from MAC. Um, sketch also from MAC on, on my outer corner. And I'm using Illamasqua Naked Rose, which is a blush that I just love and have forgotten about it. But somebody, Henny actually, one of my subscribers, she had said something about Illamasqua, the white, I think it's a white that they have that you can mix in like to lighten foundations. Anyway, it reminded me of Naked Rose, and so I pulled it out. So it's, it's bitter out there, friends. Um, Bob did go to work. Fortunately, he only drives a couple miles. But um, I need to make sure that with the wind, I'm trying to make sure that our furnace vent doesn't get blocked. So everything's canceled, like school school's canceled, and um, not places of business, of course, but school. And I don't like this candle. I love these Milk House Candle Company candles. Um, they're awesome. So it's 20 below, give or take. <clears throat> and then with the wind chill, it's 43 below. So things are absolutely, can I walked out here for something. I can't remember what it was. So I decided to do a quick little check in. I am not leaving today. That's my plan anyway. I think I, I think we have enough that I can make myself lunch and make us dinner and stuff. And um, we will be just fine here. I will be happy when Bob is home again. He's like two miles away, so it's fine. But anyway, we I have a bunch of work to do today. I'm hoping on my lunch maybe to get to edit, finish editing because I started editing. A video and get that up a vlog or not a vlog a beauty channel video because it's been a really long time and I have videos filmed I just haven't put them up and what else I guess that's about it just so I would do a check-in the rest of my drive home was less than delightful it actually is one of those drives where you just have to be on your game like from the word go you got to be on your game you can't, um, I'm going to need this to turn on, please. Um, sorry, I was talking to my computer there. You need to be on your game. and like, So I got home and I was just exhausted <laughs> from the drive. It probably doesn't sound like that makes any sense, but it, it, I was. So I went to bed pretty early, about 8.30. We got a good night's sleep and... Like I said, got up, did a live, and I'm going get to get to some work. So I just thought I would do a quick little check-in, and I will see you guys later. Like I said, oh, I'm like, where's my mouse? Yeah, took that with me. Need to unpack that, too. Um, I Like I said, I'm going to make some cookies. I'm going to make some cutout cookies, I think, and uh, like heart cookies, and I'll probably freeze them, and I want to take, well, I'll freeze some of them. I want to take some to the salon when I go this week, and I want to take some to the office. I want to take some up north next weekend, not this weekend, but next weekend. So I want to get them made and in the freezer, and then I'll put them on and frost them, or pull them, put them out. I'll pull them out and frost them when I have time. All right, that's enough of me babbling. I'll see you later. Good morning, everybody. It's about quarter to 12, actually, on Thursday morning. It is, a, it is a balmy 10 below zero, 30 something with a wind chill below. Uh, I just, I, this is what I was wearing. By the way, that's the new duvet. I still have to go get sheets and put the fancy pillows and everything, but I can't, I can't put those pillows up until I iron them and I need to do that this week. But anyway, this is what I was wearing all day, fuzzy pants and a sweatshirt. But I'm going, I have to get out of here. I can't take it. So this is like full-on cabin fever. So I have thrown on this sweater. I think I showed you that I got this when I got it. And then these are the skinny jeans from Lane Bryant that I'm enjoying very much. They're uber comfortable. And uh, I'm not even bothering with earrings or I'm just going to have lunch with my friends at the coffee shop. So not necessary. My car is, is uh, warming and I am about to bundle myself up. It has been a very busy morning. I don't know when I checked in last with you guys, but um, I, need a, I need a scarf, let's be real. But yesterday, 
did a bunch of work, and then I had two hour long, their calls that, like training calls, that, where can I put you? I'll just put you right here. I'll just put you on the plates, it's fine. There were two hour long calls, like our sales training calls, that happened, they happen once a month and I've missed the last two. So I was catching up on them yesterday and it's just, just listening, there's nothing I can do but listen. And so I baked cookies yesterday, the cutout cookies, hearts, and because I want to bring some to the salon when I go next week, so um, I don't know, I think I'll probably frost them, I don't know, maybe Saturday, we'll see. I'm going to want to be outside Saturday because it's supposed to be like warm, like 40 degrees, which is warm for us. So yeah, that's what's going on so far. I'm going to take a deep breath and bundle myself up <laughs> and head out into the cold. Good morning, everybody. It's actually just about noon on Friday, so happy Friday to me. <laughs> happy whatever day it is that you're watching this. I wanted to um, show you something. So I had gotten that Algenis package that I showed you guys before. It's snowing. Um, it's sunny and it has warmed up to 7 degrees. It's a dang dang heat wave. I'm warming my car right now, but anyway, I, I showed you guys a while back that I got a package from El Genesis and they had like a new product like teased that was coming in January. So it just got delivered today because UPS is a little behind due to the too cold for their employees to be outside. Um, seriously, I'm ruining the whole presentation here. So this is what it came in. It looks like a, you know, looks like a moisturizer container, but anyway, I take the top off and then it has some explanation of what this is, which is a sleeping collagen. And it has this, a dream routine, which I think is interesting. But look at you guys. Look at. I mean, I realize that this happens to big YouTubers all the time, but it does not happen to me all the time. And they spelled it right. Not only is the top of this have my name etched into it. I would say it's etched into it. But it's spelled right. I have an, I'm going to Instagram story about this later, but I don't have time right now. I'm taking a friend of mine to lunch. So I just wanted to show you guys because I'm pretty excited because my name is spelled out. <laughs>